I'm just suiciding to throw these nades and getting like two to five kills a life. Nine. Oh my fuck, I'm such a low skill gamer. Dude, honestly though, the beast melee monster is like huge. I'm so excited. Anyway Josh, the Guthit's Cash is a short 10 minute minigame where you uh... Basically, do regular divination stuff with some robots trying to stop you. Okay. And, uh. Depending on how many points you get in the minigame, you get a buff that lasts up to 20 minutes. Okay. That, uh, gives you a chance to save time of the porter charges. It gives you a chance for double leap from the live locations. And it gives you a chance to convert all memories at one spot. That was pretty like sweet. Crafting a whole inventory of shit. I want. Yeah. Also, Scott, you know that he got the tutorial on the perks and all that stuff. Then come out. Yep. Yeah, I don't know which tier they are. Because obviously, I don't know how to have them there. Are you on how many kills I just got in that 40 second life? 12. 11. Close. Yeah, you know, Skylar, I can't get that one until 95 minutes anyway. Oof. Yeah. At that point, who cared? Yeah, exactly. I'm having so much fun at Mason's though, like I have 49 kills on the scoreboard. <laughs> Since we went back. Since I went back. Fuck me, dude. Someone spamming the spot I was jumping down from with the lightning. Base friendly infiltrator tanking the fucking prox mine for me. Toxic. Is that there's a dude, Scott. There's a dude at this GE selling 525,000 silverhawk feathers. How long would it take you to process that? the rest of my life. 
Use them like one per tick. <laughs> yes! So... Yeah. Do you know how often you can use them around feathers? One day, I don't know. No, so you use silver hot feathers to, um, basically you put them in these special coats. Fuck! That will, uh, just use one every 45 seconds to a minute, depending on what you're doing. Yeah. So, uh... I just want to know how this man got 525,000 of them. Treasure Hunter. There's no way you get like 60 to 120 at a time! I guess. Open Jesus wallet. Christ. Spread sheets. Reestablish control of the facility. God, it's kind of sad for me right now. The um, per dummy knockover, I'm getting 4.1 thousand experience, and uh, I usually get 2,000 ish for killing those the uh, rather the trash in the uh, the newest boss. <laughs> so, yeah, dummies are fucking nuts. Well, I mean, for every one dummy kill, I could have two of the, uh, two of the trash mob kills. Do you and mean a full dummy kill, or do you mean just one dummy knockover? One, a uh, one dummy knockover is 4,200 experience. The full kills are gonna give you, like, 20k. Yeah, it's 14,000, like, 14 and a half or so. Killing my last one now. I went up a level and a half, though. Yep. Gotta go to Karamja. I mean, Scott, he's got... Now that he's got Vampiro, we can also just send him to the Abyss. Because with double XP, that's like 1.5 million XP an hour. Yeah. For what? Magic. What? You, are in a you don't have the mini... I, I know you don't have the mini quest done yet, but the mini quest takes, takes like, like five minutes. seconds. Yeah. It, the mini quest isn't really a mini quest. It's more like... A, Talk to the dude in the wilderness and then talk to him again in Barahawk. That's the quest. Ah. Unless they change it in RS3. Yeah. 